Fay Roy at uh, Bake More Music. We got another uh, show. Who's the uh, Who's the band this Thursday night? Rose Joma. Uh, we'll be here. We'll be giving away passes to that, uh, so you can uh, join us. And, and that's and, and, and so we got a good look. Oh, I like that. I like the way this looks. I know. <laughs> it's, a, it's a good situation. I, I, I like this. It. I like it too. All right. Welcome into the uh, studio, Cam Parker. How are you, Cam? Hey, I'm good. I'm doing Thank, a, thanks for ha- like up high. There you go. Right there. <laughs> there you go. It's perfect. Thank you guys for having me. I appreciate it. Um, what a great story here in the uh, Bay Area. Uh, you know, I'm from St. Pete. I uh-huh. live in St. Pete, right? Love St. Pete. So there's murals everywhere down there. And mm-hmm. it is something that just, you could be, I, you know, just driving and you're, you're, all, you're lost your head somewhere else and all of a sudden you just you know, this image one of these images will catch uh you know catch you and it just it slows me down makes me smile and it is something that brightens up the city and i'm glad to see it happening in tampa i'm really really trying along with other tampa artists to really make that like a possibility because for a while you know i, I don't feel like people thought it was like a thing that could happen but slowly but surely like we're just trying to make it happen well, and make it Permit. Well, how do, do you have to get a per? How does that work? Do you get a it, permit? Do you have it, to call, ask the? Do you do it in the middle of the night? It depends. <laughs> it depends on the like the area of town. If it's like historical, if it's if it's a business owner versus like a manager. There's just there's a bunch of ways and avenues that you can go. So it just depends on the facility, the business, the wall, the area, all the. It's it's kind of like a perfect storm situation. Let's, uh, let's bring up what we're talking about here. And Kim, feel free to pull that mic up a little closer. Okay. Um, Sorry. No, it sounds okay. okay. It, okay. Just wanted you to sound better. Okay. That's all. Um, let's see here. Now, uh, while while he looks that up, uh, you know, as he was saying, I'm actually a big fan of street art. So even the illegal kind, you know, I just I think Same. some of the stuff that we're seeing now is incredible. I've watched a number of documentaries on Netflix uh, about uh, the street art movement right now, and uh, and certainly, I mean, of course, the the big. The big name that everybody talks about is Banksy, right? Mm-hmm. Um, but there's there's a lot of incredible artists out there, and and truthfully, uh, even the illegal kind, uh, or even what some consider to be graffiti, I think it just brings color, it brings uh, life, you know, to uh, what sometimes can get to be kind of a very stale. Uh, world around absolutely. us absolutely yeah totally agree so you uh so the guy that owns this uh, wall here said uh yeah go ahead but now had you done another mural did you have to show him some of your art uh okay so her name is alana amazing alana and her team at robertson billiards um i saw a mural on one side of the wall on florida avenue and i was like okay that's cool but i want to do something too so i was like i saw the number on the side of the building and i was like okay hey do you guys have any extra like wall space da, 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 da. can i talk to someone someone about doing some sort of art to incorporate this i didn't want to cover that that one that was already there up i just wanted to like do more and there the first question they asked you was how much, <laughs> how much? Like, no 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 I, i'll free i'll, I'll do it we we, we, we or talked, did they commission you? We I I literally saw the number, walked in and was like, "Hey, can I do this?" We came to like we came to a nice fun arrangement situation and like from here they've just been so allowing and so welcoming uh and she was like literally she said I saw a mural that you did at Smoke Signals up on Florida Avenue and um I've seen your Instagram do whatever you want and so it was oh like, that's awesome I'm gonna yeah. do Lady Gaga so there was no question okay so when mind. you first saw the space it wasn't like that's where my Lady Gaga's gonna go no. you're just like I know there's something that I want this space and there's something's gonna go there yes because the wall and the and the canvas and whatever it, they they all kind of like lead you into what needs to go on it if you're intuitive enough you know uh, my wife's birthday was yesterday I think I'm gonna have to Mine buy is tomorrow she's a Scorpio happy yes. birthday what's her name my daughter's is today Yay. Yay. Scorpio Look at that. for everybody win. Yes, I love it. I love it. I love it. Uh, her, uh, she just turned thirty-one. <laughs> okay, nice. Um, but uh, you know, she is a Taylor Swift nut. You know what? I'm a new Taylor Swift nut. I'm yeah. not gonna lie about it. I'm I mean, not ashamed she, of it. Nope, it's a good situation. She, she loves everything about her. I like her. Uh, so I might have to uh, buy that one from you. Okay. But uh, this looks familiar, but I can't place it. Uh, this is okay. So Evan Peters is playing a character on American Horror Story Cults right now, and his name is Kai Anderson, and he's this. He's He's very interesting. Uh, there's, you know, for lack of a better word, um, and so there's a scene where uh, Trump wins the election in real time on the show, and you know, to rub it in his sister's face, he grinds a bunch of Cheetos up into a blender, rubs it on his face. <laughs> yeah, so that's that's where that came from. Yeah. And this is also the uh, yeah. oh, this is the cover photo as well on your Facebook page. Yes, it is. Yes, um, yeah. a couple of really cool pieces. Thank now, you. I really appreciate that. Uh, now, I just want to tap in because we got some great comments coming in. So uh, Jessica says, Scorpio here, too. 
Yeah, and uh, she says, go Tampa artists. I wish we had an alley that allowed graffiti like some of the other cities in the world. Um, and thank you to Jessica, uh, Sarah Garut for watching, Elliot uh, checking in. And uh, Jamie Coleman says he has unlimited work, people. Best artist I know. Love it. And uh, so a lot of fans out there. It, uh, but this went next level for you. This went next level because Lady Gaga has already seen this. Yeah, it was. Yeah, I was literally <laughs> somebody. You can say it, you were in tears. It's okay. I, I yeah, was almost in no, tears. No, I was in tears. I, I was like jumping up and down. My, I was freaking my dog out. She because she was like chasing after me, thinking something was like wrong. And so I was just I was calling my sister and my parents, and I was like crying. And then I was like jumping up and down. It was just a bunch of emotions all rolled in. Well, and the it one. happened within minutes, right? It happened within minutes of the story getting out that she saw it. It happened. There was there there was like a couple of days of. Tampa Bay Times posting on, oh, their, on their Twitter page and, and people were so amazing about like sharing and retweeting just constant and so I got these notifications you know um, the two days prior to her retweeting it and you know my notifications on Twitter was like seven notifications 10 notifications and all of a sudden it was like 38 notifications 56 notifications uh, 76 oh and so, wow yeah and, and so one of my friends well he's like a new friend on twitter he was like okay so you need to go look at gaga's page she's seen it and i was like no how do you know like, no way and he was like no go look at her page and i did and i was like <laughs> <laughs> yeah it was, that's it was so incredible. awesome yeah it was awesome. so yeah. she'll be in town december 1st she will um, you're gonna you're gonna sit there by the mural and just hope that she comes by and checks I'm, it out in I'm, person. I'm going to the show, uh, so I like I have to go to the show. Um, so I think I'm just gonna kind of just hang out the day prior, a little bit before the show. Maybe come back after the show. Have they reached out the next, to you? Uh, not aside Has, from not aside from that tweet, okay. but I'm just so hopeful, um, and I'm just I'm the ultimate optimist that I'm just like something's gonna happen because she's she's that artist and the reason that i did this is because she is that girl that she feels so tied to her fans and so yeah. thankful you know well you, you an interesting part of the story is when you said that you get up in the morning <laughs> and you thank three basically people yeah uh god first mm -hmm. then friend the friends and family in your mm -hmm. life and lady gaga yeah and so it's like this it's like this kind of um it's this awareness when i wake up Thank God for waking me up. I'm so glad that my thank you for making my parents and thank you for allowing them to birth me. And thank God for Gaga because like <laughs> I would be so bored if she wasn't alive, you know. Yeah. So like it's, it's so you're crazy, a little you're a little I'm, monster I'm, yourself. I am, yeah. And it sounds crazy, but I'm so sincere about it. Like I actually mean it, you know. So 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 Kim, should should I break the news to Fisher, or do you want to break the news to Fisher about the piece behind you? Uh. <laughs> I'll I'll do it because I'll do it because I don't want to I don't want you to embarrass Fisher, but I think I I have the the ability to do so. I think I think I you have guys, the right to do so. You guys have a rapport. You guys. Yeah. Uh -oh. <laughs> so so my friend that that unfortunately is not Taylor Swift. Uh, that is Michelle Pfeiffer from Scarface. Oh, yes. you're right. I was just gonna. I was By just the way, I, with man, this. why did you? Do, I, I, because I, I just assumed uh, you know we were talking about Lady nice. Gaga. He's a guest. I'm the one being rude. <laughs> I'm the one. You're an artist, and I'm sitting there going, "That's a great Taylor Swift." But I don't know Taylor Swift. Like I just assumed I just it thought, was. When I, just I see you were talking about Taylor Swift, I was like, "Cool, me too." Yeah, yeah awesome. I see it's some blonde life. white chick, and like, it's obviously it's gotta be Taylor Swift. <laughs> Oh. Which is a phenomenal. Man. I mean that that, did, that piece. I like that piece. No offense to your incredible mural, but to Thank me you. that piece is amazing. Thank that, you. Really, that Michelle Pfeiffer right there is really blowing me appreciate away. that. Yeah, how Thank many people you. caught that online too? Like, Fish that. I don't. I don't think that's Taylor Swift. <laughs> I was just. I was like, hey, maybe the, maybe he's going somewhere with this. Now, I don't know. now wow. Kim, Kim, does the name Angie Dunsing uh, ring a bell? Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Yes. So uh, uh -huh. Angie writes in. She goes, I'm so proud to have taught Cam when he was in high school. Had him in English class. Yes, he's been an amazing yeah. okay, artist yes. forever. Yes, because her last name changed since I was in LaRoe? high school. LaRoe? Because I was in high school. Is like, it LaRoe? Uh, yes. Yep, yeah. Yep. Yeah. So yep. uh, good morning to uh, Angie. Hey, Cher Angie. I yeah. miss you, Angie. So were you? Uh, Thanks for teaching me English. So yeah. a, as an artist, then uh, back in school, were you someone that didn't do your homework or was constantly doodling? No, because my dad, my parents, uh, they like they didn't even like they weren't they don't around those with games. Yeah. No, it was like A's and B's, and then you can like have fun and you can have a good life. And if you bring anything less than that, then it's not going to be not so fun good. for you. Yeah. <laughs> so I I didn't really have a choice, and they 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 raised us to you know straight out of kindergarten and like second grade, you're going to college after after school. There was no other way of thinking so I went to art school right out right out of high school and I went to Northern Illinois and DeKalb Illinois and um so it's just it's something that's always just been ingrained into me you know Johnny Torres and I were talking earlier just how uh blown away we are by your piece but but any people like you 
that can look at a wall visually, just start putting stuff up against the wall. Next thing you know, it looks like this. And it's just uh, amazing. So uh, you didn't know that you were going to put the Lady Gog up on the wall when you first saw that wall. What, what, can, you, can you help explain a non to a non-artistic person what your brain does in that moment? Your, I guess what they call your process? You, <clears throat> I, um, I just step back. I step back from the wall. I knew, so when she, when she presented the wall to me, she was like, okay, and we have this one. I was like, yes, that's the one. Like, that's the one. And I stepped back and I was like, okay, what Gaga look? Because there's so many, she's, she's, she has so many looks and I call them eras that I could have chosen like dark hair, light hair, green hair, you know what I mean? Like so many different ways that I could have uh, portrayed her. So I was like, okay, I need to like get this focused down. So I knew I wanted it to be her. I just didn't know what, what I wanted her to look like per se. Can I, can I take it back a step? Mm -hmm. when, when did you determine it was gonna be Gaga? Um, as soon as as soon as Alana said, "Do whatever you want," and I was like, it, the words it was like slow motion. It was like, "Do whatever you," want. and like I was like, "Gaga." Yeah, yeah. I started going off in his head. I know where I'm going with this always, one. It's always going off in my head. So yeah, <laughs> it is. Yeah. Um, because I think that uh, Michelangelo has some kind of a quote. Uh, I saw an angel in the marble, and I simply set him free, or mm -hmm. something. So I didn't know if it's something you look at a wall and you immediately see. You see something, and all you got to do is just bring it out of the of the uh, tapestry. Sometimes the sometimes the full the full look or the full um, idea is like right away, boom! I have to do this to get it out of me, and sometimes it it just tells me what it needs to. We talk. That's one of the. I love. I, I know that social media. There's a love hate thing, and you, we, you one day you can sit there and talk about how it's uh, connecting the world and how amazing it is. The next day you can talk about well, it's it is the. It's the world's problem. We got to do something so about the true. internet, you know. Yeah. But but we live in a time where people are doing that all the time. They're they're firing off a tweet, and the next thing you know, a celebrity, somebody they would never ever in a million years be able to have an interaction with, mm -hmm. just tweets them right back. Yeah. Just fires right back. It's. Uh, have it's you got if, uh, any other famous people uh, people besides Lady Gaga? I mean, that's a big one. Uh, like yeah. wait, that wait, have wait, ever wait. Uh, interacted with you? Tweeted? Uh, it, I've done. Checked I've, your Instagram. I've. I've done a few things for people who've like who've been like, yay, I like it, and like you know, um, I've had a little bit of interaction with like Tony Braxton, and like I don't want to name drop, but like, hey, you know, just and like, okay, so all right, can I? My tell girl you? Tony. <laughs> <laughs> can I? Oh man, okay, did I crush hard on Tony, you? man? Um, Middle I, school. Me oh, too. Boy. Oh my god, me too. Um, so. Someone, um, I wish I could remember his uh, Instagram handle, Th Third Leg Greg or something like oh, that. Oh, Third Leg um, Greg. I know yeah, Third Leg Greg. Yeah. Um, he he tweeted or he posted a picture uh, in front of paintings at uh, Patini's skating rink over in South Tampa over off of Gandia, Manhattan. And um, one of them was Missy Elliott. And she commented on his Instagram and did like the hands up sign. Oh, wow. Times, and I was like, <gasps> so he just little things like that. I'm just like, <gasps> like it just. So like are, are so are you a, a you a working artist here in the Bay Area? Were you able to make a living doing your art? Yes, it, you know as much as an artist can make a living. Mm -hmm. And it's it's a very recent situation, as of like a year and a half ago. And it's it's just a blessing to wake up and to have people uh, commission things or want a particular thing, and then come and ask me to like bring that forth for them because you can there's millions of talented people right here like in our in Tampa and St. Pete you know what I mean Sarasota yeah, maybe like, a couple dozen <laughs> <laughs> that kind of talent there's not millions in this area with I, that kind of talent I um I, <laughs> thank you but um so uh your Instagram if people want to go track you down and see your stuff Instagram you are painkiller cam yes. as well there is that two m's on 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 Twitter it's two m's but it kind of does this reroute thing and as soon as you finish like painkiller c it it just populates it for you so yeah twitter and instagram it's the same thing and then facebook it's just cam parker and yeah it's yeah a good time. well thank you so much for coming in thanks cam thanks for having me uh, thanks for uh the, the people didn't see that this broke right earlier that was all <laughs> no. on camera totally okay. fortunately thank you for uh, testing the structural integrity of our new studio you guys are welcome <laughs> yeah you're welcome and uh you're more than welcome back anytime thank you I appreciate uh, you got a net you got another piece you got something you uh, you put up uh, you know get a hold of us or we'll get a hold of you cool. and have you back on so. thank you guys and i'll make it. and i'll make sure i don't offend you the next time i was not if i was i was flattered <laughs> i was like hey yeah taylor too okay <laughs> right. cool well, definitely. Uh, thank you so much, Cam. <laughs> Thanks.